Tell them the abbess sent you, and bring the texts here at once. Yeah. <laughs> fire that burns inside. I've always had it. A longing to do something grand and important. But that door was always shut to me. My methods deemed too severe. I was cast out. Shunned. Scorned. But the Order, they took notice of me. Saw that it was courage that drove me. Courage to change the world for the better. They reopened that door. And you used your chance to destroy a way of life you did not support. We have seen time and time again what happens when people are left to interpret for themselves. Knowledge must be controlled. Only then can the message be wide the day where there is but one truth to all. This one sought to spark a new flame. But did so with a heavy hand, not a teacher's tongue. This cleansing of yours ends here. My work is incomplete, but not inconsequential. There are others who carry on, for one of the four is us. Why did you say that? What does it mean? Now I go. A flame that grows bright and burns ever more, ever light. To Helheim, where cold and cruel the fires await. What news do you bring? The Firebrand's flame burns no longer. It was Jorvik's abyss, Inkiborg. Gods, I would never have suspected. 
Does the orders reach no no bounds? None. And it is often those we least expect who carry out their ambitions. The Abbas sought to destroy all Christian texts in the city. Rid Jovic of their ideals. She did utter a phrase that perked my ears. One of the four is ours. Four? But there are only three targets in Jorvik. Could there be something we're missing? Damn Picts! Not only do they hold the North, but those lawless chicks have free roam in our lands as well. Yours said our spies are on the ground. Under the ground. Only one of them has returned, bone-beaten and bloodied. The Howling Mother take them. Lovina, a moment of your time, and hear if he's about. I will be with you shortly. Two more left to hunt. The disputes coming out of the docks lately have been deafening. Head there and dig around. Something is bound to turn up. Straight Depot. This must be where the merchants were. The Onyx Straight Depot. This must be where the merchants' wares are being kept. well guarded by the Red Hand. The Order has to stay in these docks. like the complaints by the merchants never reached the council. The 
of a needle. I'm on his trail. Seized exotic wares. He's a worth plenty. Something that could be on the Red Hand's agenda. Accumulating wealth. So, the Dark Ma Master seizes cargo and resells it through merchants in the marketplace. The ones involved bear black cloths. We may be able to get their attention by showing some silver around the marketplace. Silver to the merchants. That should get their attention. What do you mean, trouble? I don't know for sure, but the needle is calling for more protection. Meet me here at nightfall. We will go see him together. Those guards will return after dark. I might be able to follow them to the needle. <laughs> This marketplace sees its fair share of silver path through. I have something that may interest you. You will want to speak to Grigor. The Dark Master. Sorry. Someone who wants. I don't know your. Ah. Did I hear you talking about silver? I'm looking to spend the large sum. Oi! You mean the needle? You have something he wants. I shall. Oh me!
this area is off limits. The sound of metal. A workshop in the sewers. What is the needle's operation? All this silverware, some still in their crates. Has this all been seized as well? They're melting the silver into bars and coins. What do they plan on doing with it? Please, don't do this! It's a misunderstanding, that's all! I'll pay! You had your chance! I'm not surprised to find you creeping down here. You! You don't belong down here! We run a clean, and yet here a fact. Are you the Needle? Or just another of his pawns? You have it all wrong. The fabric of this world has been used up. Torn. Shredded, you see. Someone with a firm. You are a shit poet. But I <laughs> think your men are going to stop me. I would not undermine them so. The Red Hand are loyal to our cause. Which is more than I can say for the merchants. Make it quick! Meet me in the marketplace when you are done! Wait a minute! <laughs> Come, come, walk with me. It is good to walk. <laughs> Gregory. Good to take in the air. The sights, the sounds, the smells. Please, Gregory, I, 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 I didn't think you'd mind. It was just a few coins. Shh, 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 shh. I understand. It's not your fault. It was mine for thinking you had anything but empty air between your ears. With all the silver I've given you, I have nothing left to feed my children, let alone myself. Please, understand. Oh, dear God. Merchants of Jorvik, I promised you a future rife with opportunity. And what was the one thing I asked in return? Do you remember? Loyalty. Loyalty! Let this serve as a lesson, should any of you think it a good idea to threaten my operation. This place is heavily guarded. I do the thinking, you do as you're told. Why does that 
Beste, Medway und Rovis System. It's funny. As a child, I thought of snow as the tears of God, frozen by our sins. Weak with hunger, I stared into the sky, hoping it was me he wept for, me he sought to save. But God did not save me. The vault did. He took me to a fine house, gave me hearty meals, a warm bed. For the first time, someone extended a hand showed me kindness, compassion. And it was then that I made a vow. I vowed to never turn my back on he who was there for me when God was not. So you served the vault, knowing full well what he was a part of. The Order made our paths intersect. I owed them a debt, and I repaid it by saving this city from its own destruction. A life debt is a strong motivator. It took hold of this one's hookah, drove it, and never let go. Yet not with the same compassion you were shown. Too many have suffered by your hand in pursuit of this course. You're right. Perhaps I deserve this death. But I am but one cog in a large wheel. One that still turns unhindered. Not for long. Where you have gone, there will be no tears waiting for you. What news do you bring? The needle will never sting again. Well done, Neivor. Who was hiding behind the name? My love, there has been an attack at the markets. The dockmaster, Grigory, is dead. The needle. Sold off the ware as he ceased to collect silver for the vault. He had no such authority. Why would anyone believe him? The council seal. That rat. This is getting out of hand. How he was able to obtain this is concerning. I must return and prepare for the Yuletide feast, but I will do so with a bent ear and a keen eye. Be safe. A valuable seal. And a riddle. One of the four is ours. One of the four. Rhysiae, Falavith, Odin. And... Your... 
The four members of the Council. We should search their offices now, while they're occupied with the Yuletide Feast. Yes. Yes. Come, to the Archives. Could I have missed something? We will find out soon enough. Stop fooling about. needs for the Yuletide Feast. That is Aldon's handwriting. Items have been struck out. Where did he find the funds to make this larger purchase? Aldon is a well-connected man. Similar to the one I found in the sewers. The seal you took from the needle's hand. You don't think so. Scratch marks on the floor. Yor's desk used to be against the other wall. So why the change? A hidden entrance. Where does this lead? Guard the door. The room to the left. That is where the councilman confer. This desk. It looks as though it's been moved here. That's yours, It is loaded with silver. There was wine here. Whoever moved it did so in a hurry. A load of wine was removed from here, and the room smells of almonds. It may be the wine was poisoned. It is likely the wine for the Yuletide feast. Do you think one of the council means to kill someone? It looks that way. It is not him, not Mayor. He would never do this. He... Keep your focus. Once we have all the facts, then we can worry about Hyor. Right now we need to get to the Yuletide Feast. The people are in danger. You're right. The Roman Amphitheater. Let us go. Do you see the wine? No. Then there's still time. The entire council is here. Any one of them could be the vault. I need you to keep an eye out for the wine. I will speak to each of the council members, see if I can trap them in a lie. Even Hjor? Even Hjor. If he is the vault, I will not allow him to kill all these people. Lufina. I heard you. Just grant me one thing. Confer with me before you make your move. I will. Now to speak to the council members. I'll speak of... Ah! I'll speak of the wine and watch for their reactions. That may lead me to the vault. Odun. Soon defeat. We should honor you. Uh, no, no, no. Uh, but when it... I'll speak of the wine and watch for their reactions. That may lead me to the vault. 
He has indeed. A high reeve of your... Pure. Who was that? There you are. I must worry not. We have tracked... You are certain? I am. Until then, it is important that I invest... Of course. Drink yourself into a drunken fit. What? I need a distraction. Keep their eyes off of me. The wine should arrive soon. Drink three full cups, then make a scene. I can't be seen doing that. You'll have to fight... Just do it. I will have the silver ready in the coming days. Thank you, all. Of course. Eivor, have you uncovered who the vault is? I believe I have. Each of the council members... Who is it you suspect? Auden was the one pushing for the feast from the start, and he was helping Abbas Ingi. Yes. Of all the councilmen, he knew for these reasons. Brothers, before we begin, I would hear with me are some of Jorvik's most revered lords. I am pleased to say that today... The wine. Auden is the vault. Too late for them. We must not miss our chance. Join me now in celebrating their successes and yours. To everything you deserve, and to more. Shit. And now, deafened and blinded by your lust for indulgence, your foolish pride, I will tell you just what nobility is. A death sentence. A new world of order is upon us. A pity none of you will live to see it. Get the councilmen to safety. I will handle all of them. Go! There is no escape! No future for people like you! You die! You run like a cow! What did you hope to gain with all this? What riches are worth so much misery and the deaths of honorable men and women? Only a feeble mind would call them honorable. They are privileged, sedentary, complacent. They wasted their resources. I secured our power through wealth. I contributed to the future of a glorious order. On the backs of honest people, merchants, and priests, and nobles alike. A4, you are wrong. Held back by your primitive cosmology. Nine worlds in the tree? No. Nine times nine thousand worlds. And as many sons. Nine nights I hung in the tree, sacrificing myself to myself. So does the wise one seek wisdom. Countless spheres awaiting our gift, our enlightenment. I live in one world only. You live in none.
Ninjas! Farabud and his cars escorted King Richelieu back to the royal hall. Everyone is safe. Let's regroup there. Shut it, Dayer! Slack not to Aegi! 